Microsoft is coming out with new keyboards in 2024 that feature an all new AI key. But you don't have to trash your current keyboard or wait for the new ones to come out. You can simply create your own AI button on the keyboard you already have. Now, if you have something like the Logitech G915 or the Logitech MX Mechanical Keys, those keyboards have built-in programmable keys and you can use the included software to create your AI key. But let's assume you have a normal standard keyboard that does not have built-in customization options. Well, I guess you just have to smash it with a hammer, right? Um, well, actually no. You can just head to the Microsoft Store and download Power Toys, which is free. So open it up, choose Keyboard Manager, then enable the Keyboard Manager, select Remap a Key, and then we need to choose a key on our keyboard. So maybe something like the Insert Key or the Page Up Key or the Pause Key. I mean, hardly anyone uses that unless you're a programmer, or it could be one of the F keys that you don't use, you know, whatever you prefer. But I think I'll use the Pause Key. Click Add Key Remapping, click Select, and then press the key on the keyboard. Again, I'm gonna go with Pause. You can go with whatever you want. Click OK. And now we need to map Windows C, which is the shortcut to open Copilot, to our selected key. So under To Send, make sure you have Key Slash Shortcut selected. Click Select. Press Windows C on your keyboard. Click OK and OK up here, continue anyway, and that's it. So now whenever I press the pause or whatever key you selected, the AI side panel slides out. You can ask it whatever you want. Hit the key again, and it closes. So that's it. No need to buy an expensive new keyboard just to get the AI key.